guys, Sagittarius, welcome to my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. This is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out the person on your mind right now. What's their intention towards you? Today is the 18th of September, 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 22.22. So it's 10 p.m., 10.22 p.m. <laughs> That's 22.22. That's your angel number, so make sure you uh, go ahead and Google. 2222 angel number that could be some other important messages for you over there um and sag as usual i'm giving away free personal reading for a lucky winner once a week to enter hit like subscribe and comment below i love sagittarius if you've commented before you can do it again it will increase your chance in winning and winners will be announced on the community page weekly all right, Sag, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Sagittarius. Sagittarius person, what's your intention? What, What is Sagittarius person's intention towards Sagittarius? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and your person, Sag. This reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. Hermit at the bottom of the deck. Okay, Saj. Two versions here. One is if you're separated, and the second would be if it's a new person. Okay. Now, Saj, if you're currently separated from your person, I do sense them feeling really, really sad, really down. Okay. But they would like to heal things with you through your swords and love first. That could be the intention. And the, but the temperance here is in love first. So, that intention is to heal things with you, but at the same time, still carrying a lot of pain and grief. Pain or grief, I guess is similar. Um, and this is the Nine of Wands, Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Your person could be a Fire Sign. Strong Aries could be a Libra, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius again, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Can be any sign or Virgo, okay? Um, the Knight of Wands, their intention is to take actions towards you. And the justice, for some of you, it really depends who was the one who hurt the other person the most, okay? But what I'm seeing here, it's either them, either the intention is to make you feel like especially such if you were the one who has hurt them um, or betrayed them, Ten of Swords, if, okay, if that's the case, the intention is to, like, Nine of Cups looks like the intention is to kind of make you feel as bad as they've been feeling since the separation, if you are the one who betrayed them, okay? Because, but the Nine of Cups, that's very specific, and that's just for some of you. Now, the Nine of Cups is a wish fulfillment card. Do see them wanting to take certain actions towards you. Perhaps Ace of Cups would like to have this new start with you, okay? Offer you love. But right now, this moment, I see them not budging because of the Emperor. Now, the Emperor is sitting down, and you can see he's you know he's sitting down he's not moving although it's a fire energy but the emperor can also be very stubborn um so they're not budging yet so i feel like with the page of swords and lovers they're still kind of like watching you spying on you see what you're doing if you have someone new or not if there's someone you separated from if you already have someone new yeah it really hurt them okay and the hermit is them also wanting to give you some space or they themselves need some space they're currently uh, reflecting they could also be you know taking care of themselves ace of cups while they're trying to heal from this uh, separation but I do see them hoping that maybe one day both of you could justify what had happened in the past between the two of you okay um, such now for those of you 
um, if your person is somebody relatively new, when I say relatively new, it's about a year or less, okay? If everything has been okay between the two of you, the intention is to want to make sure that you're not going to betray them, that you're not going to hurt them, or it's them making sure that they're not going to hurt you, okay? Because I do sense a bit of an anxiety here where they're either afraid that they would hurt you or that you would hurt them, okay? Or both. Now, if, if there have been some issues with your new person, they feel like they need some time to be alone, especially if this new person has been kind of like acting weird towards you, like doesn't trust you. Hmm. And I do see their intention is to continue to love you or continue with this connection or seeing you, dating you, going going for dinner, lunch, or just being together in general. But the temperance here is in one first though. So it just makes me feel like they are kind of like enjoying the moment with you. But the justice is them actually portraying that they want something serious with you. But then either they don't trust themselves or that they don't trust you. Okay. Let's see a bit more. Cancer energy with the chariot. Good judgment reverse. Make sure you subscribe. Yes, yeah, Satch, it's free to subscribe. If you want a more accurate reading, that's tailor me just for you and you alone. You can book me. All info is below. We've got the Five of Swords right here. Satch, I feel like your person's intention. Now, back to if you're separated. Five of Swords could mean that, you know, they're just kind of trying to see if they want to really fight for this connection or not. Should they move towards you or not? Judgment reverse. Is it a good judgment call to like reach out to you and talk to you? Take some actions towards you. But I sense again this energy of them like sort of like they are hurt, but then hurt, but then at the same time also wanting to heal this connection. They're not too sure how to go about this right now. So they might take the time, the hermit, you know, to try and make a, a wise decision eventually okay the intention is to be wise because the hermit is very wise energy so they want to be wise in regards to if they would like to reconcile with you in the future okay and if currently you're separated and then you if you've started someone like a new relationship the intention is just to keep an eye and to see what's going to happen. If your connection will end, will it last or not? Now, Satch, back to if this is someone relatively new. And if everything is all right between the two of you, I do see them also wanting to be wise with you, with this connection. And Five of Swords, they're, they're kind of, they're not stupid. So they, they... They want to be also very practical and logical with their approach when it comes to you, when it comes to, you know, this connection take, being taken to the next level. However, if this is someone you knew but you're going through some issues with, um, they feel like, I feel like the intention is to try to play some mind games with you as well, five of swords, okay? And it seems like they do not trust you or that they do not trust themselves. All right, Saj, this is your reading. I hope it serves you well. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, all info is below. Make sure you interact with this video by liking, subscribing if you haven't yet, comment, and clicking on the bell notification button. That way it will improve the algorithm and it will also encourage me to do more of your readings i was just telling gemini gemini's reading i was just saying the same thing that uh i was gonna go to sleep because i just i went to bruno mars uh, concert last night and i'm actually a little bit tired
But then I was thinking, okay, let me do like a few signs reading uh, the ones that supported me the most, like with the most views and interaction. So make sure you continue to um, interact with this video. All right. Take care, Satch. I hope to see you back here again soon. Love you. Bye.